Ohio River Fest returns this weekend. Hal Jason Scott takes us downtown to look at some of the preparations. We're here to talk about Riverfest 2023. It's a really great celebration that happens every Sunday before Labor Day. This is my first Riverfest, so I'm just giving you the area and I've heard nothing but good things about it and I'm excited to experience it myself. We actually have really great views here at Newport on the Levee. We'll also have a lot of activities here for the family. We'll have the Cincinnati Circus here for the kids. We will also have FC Cincinnati is going to be bringing their mascot here to take photos with everyone. We'll have a lot of live bands and awesome drinks and food for everyone. It's important to uh, abstain from alcohol if you're going to be operating a vessel. Um, treat it like you would, like you're driving a vehicle, you know. It's important that if you consume, you consume responsibly. But of course, we recommend not to consume alcohol at all if you plan on boating and uh, operating the vessel at the event. There's some things to remember. If you are traveling by, uh, by vessel, if you're going to take a boat to Riverfest, so there's some things you need to be mindful of. So at noon, Sunday, September 3rd, to that Monday at 3 a.m., the river will have a no-wake zone in effect. That extends from Riverside uh, Boat Ramp to Four Seasons Marina. Uh, starting at 7 p.m. on Sunday to 10 p.m., the river will be closed from the Roebling Bridge to just east of the I-471 Bridge. So if you plan on entering that closed section, you need to be in place prior to the river closure at 7 p.m. So the river will remain closed until 10 p.m. on Sunday. So after the event, it's important to remember that regardless of when the event ends, that you remain at your designated anchorage until the, the river is opened right at 10 p.m. and then your anchorage is uh, allowed to depart and you'll notice that the vessel traffic will begin to move and you follow it orderly just to make sure it's a safe exit for all especially the amount of boats involved.